vectors spanning set multiple choice questions here we have two questions for you to understand how a set can form or can span vectors in R2 question number one is which of the following set of vectors spans R2 so we're given five choices so let's go through them one by one now before we get into this let's try to understand what are we looking for when we say that the set of vectors can span in R2, it means two things. First, they should be non-zero, right? So non-zero. And second is non-collinear. That means not scalar multiple. That is what we are trying to check, right? Not scalar multiple. So if the set does not have a zero vector or if they are not collinear or not scalar multiples then they can span in R2 right so with this let's now figure out which is the right set now the first set is 1 1 minus 2 minus 2 so this set cannot span since this is a scalar multiple right so if I multiply first one by minus 2 I get minus 2 minus 2 so it doesn't work now B is 1 2 and 2 1 if I want to get 2 from 1 I need to multiply this by 2 but 2 times 2 is 4 so this is not a collinear vector right so it is non-collinear and non-zero so it can definitely span so that is definitely our answer well let's check the others also 1 minus 1 and minus 1 and 1. In this case, if I multiply this by minus 1, I get the other one. So they are scalar multiples. Here again, we can multiply by minus 2, right? So none of them is not the option. The option is B, right? Now let's look into question number 2. Which of the following sets of vectors spans R2? Now here, we are given a couple of sets. And the important thing here is that I have included zero vectors right so we have to be careful we are looking for non-zero vectors only then two vectors could form a set that can span in R2 right so these are zeros zero vectors and zero vectors so these are not our options correct we are left with two now let's check for the second condition we want non-collinear that means if I multiply this by minus 1 I do get this right so this is like minus 1 times that is a scalar multiple or these two are collinear vectors right how about this if I multiply this by what to get this well there is no number right so 0 times anything will give me 0 but here we have minus 1 correct therefore this is perfect set to span in R2 and these are non-zero vectors so that is our answer I hope with this simple example you your concept about vectors spanning in R2 is perfectly clear I hope you appreciate it so I'll appreciate if you could subscribe and look into more multiple choice questions and understand vectors as a whole thank you and all the best